30-year-old Escambia County mother is now in jail after her six children and their 15-year-old babysitter were found in her apartment without food or running water. And Escambia Sheriff Chip Simmons says deputies also observed a roach infestation, feces, maggots, rotting food, and much more inside that apartment. Jaisha Knight now charged with five counts of child neglect and one count of aggravated child abuse. As Aubrey Spears reports, one county official says this is not an isolated incident. I spoke with a representative from the Gulf Coast Kids House who says one in nine children in Escambia County will experience abuse or neglect before the age of 18. The statistics are startling. According to Gulf Coast Kids House, the Department of Children and Families receives more than 7,000 reports of suspected child abuse every year in Escambia County. In the case of Sheisha Knight, her six children were living in conditions the arrest report calls deplorable. This is one of the worst ones that, that, that we've seen. Sheriff Chip Simmons described to WEAR what the deputies observed. There was a soiled mattress on the floor. There was a roach infestation. According to the arrest reports, one of Knight's children were also found in the apartment appearing to be lethargic and in medical distress, coming in and out of consciousness. The child was transported to the hospital and THC was found in his system, according to the report. A representative for Gulf Coast Kids House says from what they've seen in a lot of their cases, mental health and substance abuse tend to be contributing factors to general neglect cases. If people are spending their time and resources having to deal with other things, then a lot of times the kids aren't getting what they need um, as far as the resources being spent on their well-being. Lawrence says there are resources available for adults to help create healthy environments for their children through the Gulf Coast Kids House. Tonight, Knight remains in the Escambia County Jail on a $30,000 bond. Reporting in Escambia County, Aubrey Spears, WEAR News.